this little alarm clock, I think, is, you know, just super simple and styling at the same time. To get the light, you just click here on top and it stays on for a few seconds. And to set this thing is really easy. I have had way too many alarm clocks that are hard to set. Uh, to set the time on the clock, all you do is push this button and then do hours and minutes. So to set the time in hours, I would just click this and I would move up to eight o'clock or nine o'clock, etc. Um, to set the alarm, all you do is pinch right here. It's super simple. Pinch right here and the alarm is set for, uh, let's see, it's 10.02. Let's go ahead and set it. So we go hours up to 10 and then we'll go minutes and you can scroll through quickly. And I will go ahead and turn the alarm on. Oops, we gotta go one more minute. 10.04. Um, to turn the alarm on and off is just a button right here. So the alarm is on when there's that bell and it's off when the bell is gone. So right now it's set and it's set for 10.04 and we will get to hear this alarm in action. Um, it also has a little snooze button. Uh, while we're waiting for the alarm, I could just say that there are just a couple of AAA batteries in here, three AAAs. There are some alarm clocks these days that are powered up by USB and they have lithium batteries and Bluetooth and all that kind of stuff. This is a very straight up alarm clock uh, with big numbers. It's not illuminated in the dark, uh, but if you want the light, you just press this button here. So we're starting to hear the alarm clock. Um, it is one of those alarms that just kind of gets increasingly incessant. So it starts with a beep, and now it's getting to be a more intense beep, a little bit louder, a little more rapid, and then it switches to beep, 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 beep. So, uh, you know, you really need to hear the alarm clock on an alarm uh, before you buy it, I think. And if you don't get it, it goes to the ticking time bomb like that. The snooze is pretty straight up. Just press it and it gives you a couple minutes. Uh, one more thing about this alarm clock. This is actually just a big rubber exoskeleton and you can peel it off and look at the clock inside if you want to. And uh, you know, it's just a pretty simple plastic alarm clock. It seems like it's well made. It does live inside this rubber exoskeleton, which I think gives it just a ton of style. You know, it's kind of got that fun, rubbery feel to it. All right, so that's my review of the alarm clock. I think it's a pretty nice one. Um, it has uh, the features I look for in an alarm clock in terms of nice lighting and easy to set, and um, it's pretty good.